Well, we'll see how this video comes out. I know that there's not a chance that you're going to be able to see me too much, except by the listen light or light that light. Because uh, I've got you facing me as I'm driving back to pick that up from Farm Bureau meeting. But uh, if you get a moment and you're into historical um, stuff, take a minute and look up the Alpha's. Uh, this town started from 500 French traders who showed up on the shores by a little crook and trade. Um, they got here and realized they just didn't have enough money to go home. So they made the best of it. And this became a town. That's a beautiful little town. Uh, the park is... Uh, the park is the highlight, uh, especially this time of year. The river is the highlight the rest of the year. Um, personally, I really do enjoy just sitting on the riverbank and watching the uh, barges go by. We get them about all different shapes and sizes, uh, and they're all pretty cool. And they go up and down the river all year long. They stop occasionally if it ices up, but there's enough traffic on the river that it doesn't ice up very often. <clears throat> um, I'm not sure how much of this I'll keep, but we'll see. This town has like 15 stoplights, and I managed to hit every single one of them red. Uh, my store, the last two and a half years of my store was in this town. In fact, I parked right beside it when I went to go look at the park. So when we were in the store, that was always a um, was always a treat in, uh, in December to uh, take a walk down at the park, two, three o'clock in the morning. It's quiet. There's no people. Uh, they usually keep the lights on. It's nice. Anyway, for the French 500 to start this town, this town has also grown to be a trading post for a while. Uh, downstream from uh, Marietta, Ohio. This is our first, our first town here. Uh, as many of you know, I am a Mason. I'm very proud of that fact. Gallopolis was the first actual lodge that was chartered after the Ohio after the Ohio Grand Lodge was formed. Um, the lodge here is number seven. It's called Morning Dawn. Uh, the first six lodges uh, went together and formed Grand Lodge, and they were from all over the uh, all over the state. But um, Morning Dog was the actual first one that was chartered. So that's nice, and I belong to that lodge, uh, as well as the one in Patriot. Um, we call it Patriot, but it's spelled Patriot. And depending on where you live in the county, you may call it Patriot, or you may call it Patriot. But this is Gal Plus. Another fun little town is Rio Grande. It is spelled like Rio Grande. Uh, there's an old college there from uh, Bunch of Calvinites that uh, went together to create an educational school, uh, teachers' college. It's growing from there. Anyway, we are in the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains. We are alongside the Ohio River. Um, the other side of the river is. Point Pleasant, another very historical town. Um, we are at the confluence of the Kanawha River, uh, which comes out of Charleston and is tied into the New River, uh, which is one of the oldest rivers in the United States. Um, the, don't know why I 
I got named Lou, but I do know that the Lou River and the Susquehanna River over in um, Virginia were the two oldest rivers in the continental U.S. from my understanding. Fun fact. One of the trips we'll be doing at some point is called New River Gorge. Um, and it's basically that. It's a great big huge cut out of the middle of the ground. It's, uh, it's pretty cool for what I hear. I've never seen it even though it's only a couple, three hours away. So, uh, at some point we'll go take a look at it. You know, I might just make this a separate video. Probably not. Nobody will watch some black video of some old dude talking and rambling on about his hometown as you're driving down the road when you can't see anything. But who knows? If it's weird enough, somebody might watch it. And I like to do that kind of stuff. I love to ramble for no reason whatsoever. Either way, I'm getting close to... Uh, where dad's meeting was so uh, I will go ahead and end this video here and you all have a good night have a Merry Christmas fantastic holiday time frame Christmas and New Year's and uh, we'll get back with you next time thank you much